I really want to hear you. <laughs> I want to hear you talk about, the, like, um, Allison has pioneered this amazing technique that she calls unwinding the belly. And I so love that image of unwinding the belly. And I just, I like, can you just say, I mean, you're talking about it already, but can you just give a little bit more well, description? It is just what we are talking about. It's using your breath, though. It's actually be, learning how to comfortably be in your body. We're not comfortable in our bodies. A lot of this food also, a lot of this agricultural farming, a lot of this ramped up culture, um, which is so nice to see you all here just relaxed, listening and being together, because everybody's in such a rush and every nobody's on their phone. I mean, it's like, I'm so happy, because all we're doing all day long is rushing, rushing, rushing. So what happens when you rush? <laughs> Shoulders to the ears, diaphragm up into the chest, fight or flight system on, and you get so exhausted, eventually you're just, you, we collapse, but it's still happening in there. And when that's happening in there, not only are you, 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 you create a body every minute of every day, right? Wow. That's the beauty of being human. We, we take this for granted, but every minute, every second, you're making bones, you're making muscle, your fluids are moving. Taught, oh, I need this, oh good, I'm gonna digest this. And, and what I assimilate is gonna become my organs. It's gonna become my inspiration, it's gonna become who I am. Well, if we start getting stuck and hypervigilant and ramped up, or we're shut down and disassociated, nobody's talking to each other in here. And we're not breathing, we're breathing enough to stay and not because mm. we're getting sick. So it's survival breath. So it's survival breath, yeah. exactly. So we need to come back to the breath, not only through in meditation, which is a wonderful thing that I participate in every day, but it's hard to meditate if, you're, if you can't breathe, if you're only feeling how tight and there's, you know, you're hoping the breath is gonna to come to you if you just sit there. Mm -hmm. But if we learn the mechanism of the breath, if we learn how to be in our body, which I think tapping is yeah. actually incredibly helpful for, mm -hmm. then we start to change, which is the nature of the universe, which is why I'm so optimistic. <laughs> because no matter what's going on in your body, you, you, can, you can go from sick to well. You mm -hmm. can be at death's door and thrive. I've seen and, it over and over and over and over and over again. And the impulse of nature always is toward healing. That's right. 